it get it got worse yeah but i feel like it's about to get worse on well all right now matching outfits i see ya what's up my vina loves it's miss vina d and you're watching vina team and unfiltered of course i've been watching love island games i've just been extremely busy on my first channel my career and life in general so that's the reason why i have not been posting on love island games but i've seen every single episode of course what i said a few months ago i was right i said I wouldn't be shocked if I see Scott or Amani back on Love Island doing the Love Island games. And I was right. Scott came on last night. And of course, Amani been on since the beginning. So I was right on that. Catherine probably said no after seeing how they did her dirty with the editing and all of that. All of the backlash that she faced when she left the villa. Everything have calmed down now. Catherine is doing well. Catherine and Scott actually reunited a few days ago. I have those videos coming and all of that. But this would have been perfect for Catherine to be on Love Island Games. And she and Scott's story, you know, would have or could have played out on there. But she probably turned it down. And also, when you are locked up in the villa for a long time, yes, you're meeting new people, having a great time. But it takes a lot on your mental health. So I'm glad she's just happy to be out free and doing her thing and also you have justine and jack in the villa as well so it would have been a lot of power couple situation going on had catherine come on but she's just like you know what if it's going to work out if it was meant to be it has to happen outside you know in the real world and not because we're fighting for money or a check because i need to make sure that it's real and they always bring scott back when it's like two seconds left in the show it's like how do you expect him to find anyone uh, when you're bringing him in when it's over however scott is clearly not looking for that when he's thrown into these situations within a short amount of time now let's get into why you're here justine is playing scissor snooze so i can't play the original audio and background but they render each other hug each other now production is working over time okay look justine and jack we see that twitter and social media is eating this up okay so go ahead and play on it post the videos post the matching outfits post everything okay because we need the views and we need all of it all right now for the people who are saying oh they're ruining it and spoiling the show by them posting these videos is making it look like they did end up together and all of that even if they did not this is good for the show because people are into their story and their journey they're going to keep tuning in because i did see some of those comments why are they posting it why are they showing it oh this is confirmation they're together this could be confirmation that they're together or confirmation that you know what we live in different countries and we have decided to be best friends because the distance is just too long or they are dating and figuring it out because think about it love island games is what three four weeks that's a short amount of time even though yes in the villa it might feel like four years <laughs> but we shall see i do wish them the best i'm not touching you i'm not touching you <laughs> Fifteen out of ten. Wow. That's quite stunning. Is it a fifteen? Queen. The growling is actually crazy. BFF Sally with the camera work, okay? She's feeding Justine and Jack supporters right now with all of these behind the scenes pictures and all of that. They look great together. So like I said, we'll keep watching the show. It's almost over and we shall see. <laughs> the growl is crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't hurt him. Don't hurt him. He, he. <laughs> the growl is crazy. Now, most of you are aware if you're watching the show, Justine and Jack, J and J, they are the power couple in the villa. They've been together since the beginning for a while of course they're not exclusive but you can clearly see they like each other and they are locking things down even though that conversation did not happen yet jack almost went home just justine been on the bottom a few times on the bottom meaning you know at risk of going home being vulnerable and the both of them almost went home last night but she was saved 
and he won his match so they are still on the show i know i said he won his match meaning the duel <laughs> when the announcer says it that way every time he is so silly one of the main conversation that they had was the fact that they live in different countries and you know she's open to traveling and he's also open to traveling if they do decide to make it work outside of the villa and as you can see they are trying whether it's just friendship or they are in a relationship i wish them the best i did see a clip of justine and Sally to do a recap of each episode Sally is talking about when she knew that jack was the one for her best friend justine and all of that so it's possible that they are doing their best to make a long distance relationship or friendship work. I'm not going to put his image on the screen, but Justine last situation didn't work with the guy that she want Love Island with. So you had people, you know, some of her supporters like, oh my goodness, here we go again, but I don't care. And like I said previously, you have to understand that it's four weeks, four weeks, okay? So even if at the end, these two are choosing friendship and then building on that that's great but if they are together that's great as well because he had that girl crying good tears you know she's been trying she was at the point where she felt like love and relationships were just not for her and then to meet someone you're having a connection with and that makes you go from thinking okay i'm the problem it's me so you know what maybe it's not me i just didn't meet the person that was compatible with so like i said i do wish that it works out for them Kelly reposted that scene and she wrote the most worthy, finally finding someone worthy. As you can see, Justine is talking about the connection that she has with Zach and everything I just said. You do have the here we go again, people. I'm not believing, you know, these lies for a check and all of that. And to that, their supporters are like, they can scam me all the way to the bank because I'm a run with them. So there you have it. Please do not forget to support my main channel. The link is in the description below. Also the link to my boutique website. I'm wishing all of you well and take care. I love, thank you all for your love and support. If you're not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and leave this video a thumbs up. Also turn on notifications so when I do post you where I post it and I will see you all in the comment section. Remember to always have the God bless attitude which is being positive at all times and seeing the good in every situation. Have a great day guys. God bless.